These lanes loaded with high rollers. The big blue bowling teams come rolling in with nine women and eight men. Six from each side will look to strike it big in competition. On the men's side, it's a little more local and regional, so we have a few folks from Nebraska on the men's team and in Iowa as well, but uh, mostly regional and local for the men's team. Fundamentals are big. Um, a lot of them are, are gifted athletes, but we have to learn fundamentals, balance, straight arm swing, following through straight, hitting your target. So a lot of just basic fundamentals. They have power. A lot of them have a lot of power on the ball, which you'd like to see. I was at the touring center, and the lady at the front desk was like, yeah, we got a bowling team. And I was like, I played bowling in high school, so why not in college? So I wrote down the information, and then she took it, and then gave it to coach. And then coach contacted me, and then we're, we're here. So the women's team is a little more nationally based. We definitely have a strong local foundation too. We have you know, four or five strong bowlers from the Iowa, Nebraska region, and you know, we're roughly four from a long distance away. We have a, a, a Florida, we have a Washington State, we have a, an Illinois a bowler on our team. So the women, typically, it's, it's funny in bowling, they have a little bit more of a fundamentally sound game. So for them, actually, it's harnessing more of that power. So it's a bit of, um, how do we say, trying to get them to find their maximum amount of power while controlling it. The biggest is probably adjusting to, well, the people, because you don't know anybody, and then the lanes, because they're all different. He's cool. He's one of the best coaches I've ever had yet. I like them. They're nice. They're easy to get along with. They're funny. They're pretty light going, but just don't get on their bad side. <laughs> like, no, it can't open this. It's work. And I, and I like it. I like to work. I think, you know, again, this is not going to be easy at all. Even though I'm optimistic we can do a lot of great things, it's, we've got to work for it. And I like that. I like to be in the trenches and, and really focusing on X's and O's and, and working on everybody's game day by day. The Reavers are counting down the days till their first tournament. Iowa Western rolls in a new era October 13th at an event in Lincoln, Nebraska. Life in the fast lane with the big blue bowling teams. One, two, three. Dance, Dance up! up. Oh!